I'm, I'm aiming for the middle. Okay. This is good, yeah? Yeah. Let's put all at once, Susan. Yeah. Yeah. Uh huh. Smells good. Okay, now I'm scared. Now Stir I'm it. actually scared. Stir it. Ouch. Ouch. Okay. Hello, everybody. Welcome back. It's been a while. <laughs> Almost a month. A while. <laughs> Today, Warchi is going to teach me how to make chicken fried rice. This will be pretty easy. It's just chicken fried rice. So we just obviously have rice, chicken, tomatoes, onions, and a little bit of garlic. Mm -hmm. We don't have any other vegetables right now. I think if we had carrots, we would use carrots too. Just a simple one. First, we'll cook the rice and then we'll do the preparation for the chicken. Okay. And on then, we'll, the do, we'll cut the vegetables. Okay. Okay. Okay, so we got rice. Okay, can you put one and a half cup? So we do one and a half cups when we eat rice because Warchi typically eats one cup and I typically eat half a cup. So we just keep this cup, this measuring cup mm -hmm. in the rice. Okay, I think that's good. Is that good? Yeah. Okay. All right, so we'll take this in the kitchen and we will cook the rice. I think Warchi cannot live without a rice cooker, and I think just Thailand in general has to have, everyone has to have a rice cooker. Okay, so we have here chicken, tomato, spring onion, garlic, and onion. So that's what we're going to use. And later on, we'll put a little bit of chili powder. Or do you want a cream chili? Either way. I think chili powder and a little bit of salt, right? Oh, of you? course, we have to put salt. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right, so let's do the cutting, yeah? I am not an expert in cutting tomatoes, so you may not want to, you may not want to take any tips from me. <laughs> right? <laughs> I often have to ask you, how do okay, I Give me your this? knife. Oh, you're gonna sharpen it? Oh gosh. It's a little bit scary. Here you go. Okay, thank you. All right, one more tomato. These are the tomatoes we buy from the market and they're always really small like this. In the US, I'm used to um, more round and a lot bigger. Okay. Okay, so now I'll cut- I got the spring onion. Okay, so maybe just like this? Yes. Is that too big? It's okay. Do they normally put spring onions in fried rice here? Uh, um, yes, some. But I like, I like spring onions. I like when they put carrots. Is this, that's enough, yeah. Okay. okay. Onion. Ooh. Okay. Slice it in the middle. Okay, we gotta do this fast, right? Cause I don't wanna cry. Okay, and then, and then what? Separate it. And then start cutting side by side, like this. From the side. Oh, okay, so put it down like this. Yeah. Like this? Yeah. Ch -ch -ch. Yeah. Okay. Good. So when you when you peeled it, you you wash it after that. So I think that's part that's supposed to help. Mm -hmm. Okay, I've never cut garlic before either. So normally what I do is like I take like this in a big knife oh, and yeah. I smash it. So do that. Okay. Way. Why do you? Okay. Like good. that. That's yeah. good enough. Why mm -hmm. do you do that? Okay. Well, that's easy then. All right. So that's part one. Is that a good size, do you think? Uh, make it a little bit smaller. Okay, like this? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, this knife is not so good. So use the bigger knife. Okay. So we have too much chicken. We're not gonna, we're gonna cook all of it, but we're not gonna put it in mm -hmm. our fried rice. We got so for this chicken, what I'll, I'll tell you is before you cut, cut it in the middle so that it becomes, yeah. But it's kind of not fun to cook things that you don't eat with me, you know? Because mm. I think, isn't that part of the fun of cooking is seeing the enjoyment of the people that you made it for? Yeah, I mean, so I think if, if you ask that, everyone who cooks, that's the... That makes you happy, food, right? right? When yeah. I love your food. So it's kind of... Cooking is just a means to an end, I think, for me. It's not like, oh, <laughs> I love this. That's what I figured it out. Yeah, cooking is... I mean, eating is just a 
for me, it's just kind of a task to check off. It's not something that I'm, uh, that I get really excited about. I mean, I do love tacos though, but it's, and I just, I need to say, it's not my mom's fault that I don't know how to cook. I was never interested in it. So no one is blaming you, mom. You're gonna have to tell me when to stop. Is that it? Uh, no, put more. It's fried rice, remember? Yeah. Okay, that's good. Is it <laughs> fried rice or deep fried rice or deep, deep fried rice? Your, yeah, Thai food always has oil and, and Naga food always has oil, right? Well, I think not, too, not much oil. I've never cooked onions in oil by myself before. So this will take like <coughs> about three or four minutes to, to get hot enough. To get it hot. I know some people just started cooking when it's just a little bit warm. But for me, I prefer it when it's really hot. Why? Then because it's faster? When I put the onion, <coughs> it's like pshhh. It sizzles. I like that sound. It sizzles. And then it turns quickly brown. Can you make me some like gloves that go <laughs> all the way up to here? So if the, if the oil... As we are waiting for the oil to <coughs> get warm, let's just talk about food. What's your favorite Thai food? I think fried rice is... Well, that's a hard one. I love fried rice. I love green curry. Okay. I love red curry. I love khao man gai, which is the oily, kind of oily rice with boiled chicken oh. and the chili sauce. I love that. Okay. And the soup that always comes with chicken soup. I think those are my four favorites. I think ours is totally different. Totally different. You don't like green curry yeah. at all. For, for me, I like this isan food. Oh, sometime. Sometime. Gai yang, grilled chicken. Grilled chicken, sticky rice. Yeah. I love sticky and rice too. And the mushroom soup. Yeah. So those those will be my. That's your favorite. Favorite. Okay, are you ready? Yeah. Am I gonna try to? Don't 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 throw like this. I know. Do Gently. it slow. Can I try to put it in the middle since the oil is? Sure. Not more onion. Do you want more spring onion or what? No, that's okay. That's good. Okay. See, now I now I remember why I've never done this because of that. I know that you're not scared of that. Why are you not scared of that? Because it never hits you, I, unless you are very rough. I mean, it's, but I'm sure it's hit you before. Like that is a lot of oil. Oh gosh. Okay, I'm, I'm aiming for the middle. Okay. This is good, yeah? Yeah. Let's put all at once, Susan. Yeah. Yeah. Uh-huh. It smells good. Okay, now I'm scared. Now Sorry. I'm actually scared. Sorry. Ouch, ouch. Okay. <laughs> Yeah. Ugh. Don't you think that's too much oil? No. We're going to put rice, remember? Yeah. Okay. Should I go get it? No, no, no. Are we going to start the smoke alarm? No. Right. Smells good, yeah? Yeah. You know it's smelling good? No. It's the garlic. Even though there's hardly any. Right, compared to the amount of chicken. You can put a little bit of the tomato, a portion of tomato. Okay, that's good. It's time for rice, so bring along salt and chili powder. Just separate it a little bit? Yeah. Because if you put it in a, what it'll, do you say, bulk? It'll stick together. It'll stick together. Okay. The, the idea of fried rice is you want all the pieces of rice to have that oil, you know? Okay. Uh, I want you to put the salt. Okay. So I know how you put salt. You lid. just, yeah, you just go like this, which is why it's all rusty. Is that enough? No, more and more. Okay, this is a lot of salt and oil. Let's just stop. More. Let's stop there. Okay, is okay. that all right? And then is this going to like... No. Okay, that's, that's nice. It doesn't shoot up at you when you put... Ooh, look at this. It's turning brown. It. I wish we had carrots. Do I need to keep doing the rice or is it good now? Okay, I think you can put the rice now. Okay. So I'm going to put all of it, right? Yeah. So bring the cooker closer. Okay. So this is one thing that all your food has in common. Your food always has rice, right? Yep. So this is something, I think you don't like fried rice as much as I do, but... Well, in India I like, but 
I like more soupy stuff, you know? So you make, you eat fried rice in India? Oh yeah. Like at a restaurant or at home? At a restaurant. Oh, like a Chinese restaurant. Yeah. Okay, so this is a little bit different. Good job. Is this too much rice and no. not enough chicken? No, it's good. Okay. Now I feel like I want to put cheese in it. No. I know. Hello. I'm, I'm just saying I feel like I won't. Okay, so finally, Susan cooked <gasps> up. I'm tired from standing. <laughs> so it's done. Our simple chicken fried rice is done. It's two o'clock. We're hungry, yeah. After lots of cooking, it's time to eat. We're hungry. It's time to eat. You pray? Yeah. Go. God, thank you for providing this food for us. And thank you for always looking after us. Please bless this food to our bodies. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. All right. I Let's think it will be good because basically this is your fried rice and all of your food is good, Jihan. Not enough salt? <clears throat> See? You can talk as much as you can. I know, but, but I don't want to say that. That's okay. But otherwise the flavor is really good apart from salt and chili. So this is actually a Burmese um, chili mix. Chili mix with fish. Dried fish. Dried fish. So for me this is gonna be like perfect blend. Could have fantasized. 